know, I kind of pushed for it. They weren't even going to put any HVAC system in here initially until, you know. Well, they did. But then it was kind of like, well, no, the people are going to be doing anything in here. You have to have that. You have to have lights. I have never seen a raw vault before. I didn't realize that they were that seriously built up. Good Lord. That's pretty impressive. You do the primary beam walls. You see their... Oh, yeah. For the, main axis, for the main axis of rotation, yeah. Yeah, this is about where... Uh, probably about here is about where ISO center is. So that's the main axis. And then you have the side shielding. So they have to be thicker because that's where beams can shoot directly. These are about eight feet thick on the primary beam wall to the outside. Eight feet? Eight feet tall? Yeah. High density concrete. Wow. Okay. This all has to be done as a monolithic core so you don't have any uh, gaps. So all this had to be one continuous core. They couldn't like, do it with lifts. Stages. Wow. They had to pour this all in one continuous massive concrete to keep pumping and build the form and build all the way up. You can't have any voids, which uh, a step pour will give you. That's a hell of a accomplishment. Yeah. That's uh, a just that we'll see here. <clears throat> and a finished vault. Personally, I like the raw vaults better.